So why winter? And this is where, yes, there is a particular role of, say, stubble burning, which is the burning of paddy straw by farmers in Punjab, Haryana, and even UP, or Diwali crackers. It adds. Let's, let's, not, let's not make a light of this. It definitely adds to the crisis and the challenge of air pollution in that particular month of October and November when winter comes in. And this is clear from the data which has been, which gets put out by what is called a decision-making support system of the Ministry of Earth Sciences. So what they do is to look at what is real-time pollution, what are the sources of it. Now, if you compare these, this data, you will find that in the week when paddy burning happens and the winds bring it across from Punjab and Haryana to Delhi, then the contribution of that pollution to the overall pollution of Delhi can go up to 25%. But still, the bulk of the pollution remains of Delhi's own sources, of which vehicles are key. And in the week after, when the paddy burning has come down and the impact of Diwali is over, then you will see that it is Delhi, which is the key source, contributor to the pollution, its own sources, the surrounding areas, and within that, vehicles again top the list. So that's really what data shows us and helps us to understand what we must do. So we need to be able to deal with the long-term, year-long sources, and we need to have solutions for the paddy burning, which is an episodal pollution, which tips us over. That's the science of air pollution.